First run for Lindsey Vaughn and a lot of very worried American ski fans. And of course, with the Olympics so close, this was a tough first run for Lindsey Vaughn, the defending, the two-time defending overall World Cup champion. A big scare, Paula, down further on this run. She will take a crash that she thought she broke her arm. Everyone else did. She ended up going to the hospital, got an MRI and x-rays. There is no fracture. But leading into this, she was so excited about Giant Slalom. This is her weakest event. It's the only discipline in which she hasn't won a race. And Thomas, her coach and husband, has said she's been training fantastically, top three in the world, really, really looking forward to this race. But right down here in the shade, watch what happens here. She hooks up and takes a tough fall onto her left arm. And it's her distal radius that she injured, which is right up near the front of the wrist there. And just look at how hard she lands on it right there and then slides very, very icy. This is injected snow, as most of the races are now. And that itself is a bit of controversy, whether they need to be icing these slopes as much as they are. Well, talk about heart in the throat, not only for Lindsey Vaughn, but for everybody who has followed her tremendous career. She's already dealt with a couple of very serious injuries. Remember the very notable one leading up to the Torino Olympic Games injured her knee in a downhill race just previous to those Olympic Games, went on to finish eighth there, and then injured her th thumb severely at the World Championships last year, actually taped her thumb to her pole and went on uh, and won a couple of titles there. But this was a very dangerous fall, immediately getting all sorts of attention. Lindsey Vaughn is one tough cookie. She has proved that she knows how to race injured and race well, as she did last year. She ended up winning the World Cup title, racing the entire rest of the season with her hand in a splint because of that thumb. Uh, this a big scare, as we said, the U.S. team medical director, Richard Quincy, said it was, uh, you know, that we spoke to him between runs, as we did Thomas Vaughn. Uh, her husband, who said it's just the best news we could have had out of the hospital. She's in a lot of pain, but you know them. They were already talking about, hey, if it's broken, we're going to race with it broken. What do we do? And uh, and now that they know it's not broken, they're uh, looking forward to the slalom already and saying if, I, if she's not in too much pain, she'll race the slalom in Lienz as well.